teaching pre-calculus and calculus to undergraduate kids. And um, the one thing that I wanted to do was assign them homework, and before they entered the classroom, I wanted to know how many of them have actually done the homework, what are the concepts that they are struggling with, how much time they have spent, and so on. Unfortunately, we were using Blackboard at that time, and I could not do it. Um, five years down the line, I was 27. I wanted to go to business school, and um, I was preparing for a GMAT exam. And one of the only kind of affordable solutions that existed was actually buying an ebook. And it was a horrible experience because it was not interactive, there was no feedback, there was no engagement whatsoever. So I realized that um, it was the engagement and the data and uh, data analytics part of it which was missing both from the student and um, teacher point of view. And that's when um, me and my co-founder decided to take things in our hand and build bench prep. Today, bench prep is the only interactive learning platform that can deliver courses and curriculum across multiple devices. A student can study across computer, iPhone, iPad, Android, Android tablet in a very seamless way. We have been around for about 30 months and in 30 months uh, more than 400,000 students have used bench prep courses. We have delivered more than 4 million assessments. Um, and of course, I can do this alone. Uh, we have 28 publishers, the best and the biggest, that are providing us content to, to deliver these 250 courses. We are a Chicago-based company, 25 employees, three amazing investors, uh, NEA, New Enterprise Associates, um, Revolution Ventures, and Light Bank. So what exactly do we do? We at Bench Prep take the existing textbooks, study guides, um, you know, workbooks and break them down into these interactive courses um, that are very data driven, um, semantically connected and can be delivered across multiple devices. Think of it as an accounting 101 textbook, uh, a geometry workbook, a GMAT study guide. We would go to existing publishers, take the ebook and deliver a much better learning experience um, using the same content. And the core philosophy is we believe ebooks are just not enough for education. Um, we have to take the content delivery on to the next level. So what we are doing is we take the ebook um, and we create an entirely new product category, which is the interactive courses. The another thing that we do is um, we are actually creating a lot of economic value for publishers. Uh, we are living in a world where a $20 physical book um, is getting a lot of downward pricing pressure um, when it comes to an ebook and it's being sold at $9.99. We can add a lot of features on top of it, create a new product category, and create value as high as $99 for a course. But the one thing that I'm most excited about is our ability to actually deliver or track engagement analytics. Most, almost all of the ebook platforms do not, do not provide any analytics back to the publisher. We can track every single minute click and answer and really help publishers get better at content delivery. Um, and that's, that's why publishers love us. I mean, we were working with some of the biggest um, publishers in, in, in all capacities. Um, but the most important thing is students loving us. Um, we are actually building the product for students uh, from a student's point of view. We are seeing phenomenal engagement where there are 70% of students are actually using these courses on multiple devices uh, and spending as high as two and a half hours um, a week. Um, and the results are showing, I mean, what's the point of building a flashy technology if we cannot prove that it works? Um, what we can show now is over a period of three months as a student is using a bench prep course, they see an average um, score impro improvement of about 16%. Even that was not enough for us. So we started looking at the data that we get from our engagement analytics and started to identify behaviors that we can then encourage um, to improve student um, scores. On left hand side, um, what you see is um, we, can, we can now show that if a student is using bench prep courses, or in fact any course, um, on multiple devices, web and mobile, their score Im improvement is 40% higher when they just use single device. So going back to our hypothesis that that courses need to be delivered on multiple devices is proven right here. On the back side of things, as we license content from publishers, we can actually share concept level, page level, question level analytics back with them. 
Here is an example of an MCAT book that we licensed with McGraw Hill. We can actually show the top five questions that the students are struggling with, or the top five lessons that they're actually marking as low confidence. This is the kind of data that we can take, go back to the publisher, and start making recommendations. Um, a publisher can actually add an example or connect an assessment unit back to the remedial content based on what, how students are actually interacting with uh, this kind of content. Another view into data analytics, and analytics is um, typically we see students taking multiple courses on bench prep. Um, student would start with, let's say, an AP exam course. They would end up taking a biology course, and then an SAT course, and an accounting course. And we can actually study the kind of clusters um, that they're forming and influence uh, the learning pathways that the student would take over a period of time. This is one of the most important views, um, uh, the classroom or a student level view from a, a teacher point of view. Right now, there are about 35 um, school districts in um, Connecticut, another 15 school districts in Pennsylvania, uh, Pennsylvania and 20 school districts in uh, New Mexico that are actually using this platform and are looking at student level and class level data to inform how they would be, should be teaching inside of the classroom. Essentially, what we want to build is a learning platform that can deliver a lifetime of learning. A student comes in during high school uh, trying to study for AP exam course. Next thing is SAT. Next thing is Accounting 101, all the way to professional certification. And that's what Bench Prep is.